Well, we have no sound settings here. Yeah, I can see no sound settings in this game, but it's a little interesting indie that got my interest. Yesterday, I don't know when it was launched, when it was launched, but uh, it's a nice CD. <laughs> and I'm looking forward to try it. <clears throat> yeah, I said uh, earlier this evening that I will uh, try an indie for you, and then that indie's name is that indie's name is uh, you must. I don't know what to think about this indie, I will try it and uh, we will see. We will see about this. If I like it, if, I'll, if I will don't like it. I mean, uh, let's check it out. I don't know what to say about this game. Hopefully I won't get scared. Hopefully I won't get scared by this game, so let's start a new game. The money will buy me help, okay. Okay, so here we are at the place. I don't know what to say about this place, man. I'm really. Oh, 
Okay, so here we have a nice fireplace. It says let's find the items. I don't know what items items I should find here. The game is not that bad, you know. It looks really awesome from what I see. But there are items scattered all around and I can't find them that easy. So it's gonna take me some time until I find them. And th there is that big guy that's guarding the outside door. And I can't get, I can't actually go outside. Because if I go outside, I'll probably get caught by him. Hopefully he's in the courtyard. Wait a minute, I can jump. I got stuck here, man. What kind of bullcrap game is this? I mean it. It's a total crap, man. No, I can't get out. He's coming.
Okay, so here's the place. Yeah, I said I would play this game, but I cannot. So Holy shit, now that was, was creepy. this anymore. You got to have a strong heart in order to play this game. It's creepy. It's really creepy. Yeah, there's pretty much a hide and seek game where you have to hide and find some items. Yeah, I won't be able to finish to search for those I those items because it's very dark. And I'm not I'm I'm not liking it anymore. I'm not liking it anymore because you can jump, you can do anything. You have just a few lives, you don't have any weapon to defend yourself from the from the big guy. Yeah.
Shit game. I'm gonna come gonna quit. You can do nothing here. You just hide and seek from that big guy, and uh, that's all. You have nothing to do. You know, you have no quests. You have no objectives on uh, on the corner. It's just a concept of a game of a hide and seek game, like uh, Outlast or something like that. Yeah. But it's unfinished and it has no jump it has no jump function on the character you can jump the thing that I really hate about this game you don't have any jump option and uh, that guy keeps circling around the courtyard and you can't do shit because he, if he sees you he will kill you you know that's basically the whole game just have to search for some stuff and that's all. Yeah, I have nothing to do. Nice music, nice everything, but uh, the game mechanics suck, so I can't play it. I, I just can't, can't find the entrance to the to the upper levels of the building because of that guy circling around and it's coming inside the building and I can't do anything, you know. And more than that, there are those scary moments when you see things crawling around, the, you know, you see ghosts inside the building and that's another point that I think uh, it's not what, what she should be, you know. It's not a game for me, I mean, I'm not playing horror games anymore for a long time and uh, I play only simulation games and good games. That are no based on that, that, that are not based on uh, on uh, horror effects and uh, horror scenes and uh, things like that. I don't want to play games that have horror scenes because I'm tired of horror scenes. I don't want to play horror games. So, if you think you like this game and you can finish it, just go ahead. I won't finish it because I already. I already got scared like hell in that moment when that crawler went past by, passing by, went uh, near me, you know. And uh, there was also the big guy outside, and uh, I couldn't do shit, you know. So I'm leaving you guys here to watch the, this short gameplay that I did, and to appreciate or not to appreciate. I got scared like hell and I don't want to play this game because it's scary and it's uh, it has some heart pumping moments and it's also uh, you know, not, not that big you have only yeah. no, whatever Yeah, you have only a building, and that's all. You have only a, an abandoned factory with some messing up lights, with some messed up lights, and that's all. And you have a few fireplaces where you can go, but these are your only guides in this game, and you can't find shit, you know, because that big guy is gonna come after you and finish you or you will see another horror scene uh, that will uh, creep you up so no thanks I will not play this game so I'm leaving you guys here hope wish you a good night and see you guys in another game that I will probably choose to play this night not this one okay I'm uninstalling it I'm deleting it from the torrents it's not my kind of game. 
So goodbye and have a great night.